Imagine the weight of being the first. You have to look the part. You've got to maintain, you know, the, the image of the one that can make it. Royal comes in in 57. This was at the integration of the university. And then there was a release of the ban on black players. And then you start to see integration of the sports. That is the backdrop for Julius coming to the University of Texas. There was some excitement. There was some pride, especially from our parents pushing us to, to be what we can with what our abilities are. We wanted to see change, but we also wanted to take advantage of this opportunity that we'd been presented to be educated at the University of Texas Law School. I think in the trajectory and the history of the university and the law school, the university really supported and was behind its affirmative action policies. From Julius's time to the present day, what we've seen are the ways in which there are concerted moves forward, then there are often setbacks. Julius took on more than just the burden of being the first black scholarship player. He represented the dreams, the hopes, the aspirations of a lot of African Americans throughout Texas that believed that we, our children, should have the same fullness of that experience that so many other Texans had had. So it was something about Julius that made it possible for him to navigate that environment and break through those barriers. You see later in Julius's life that he, that's what he does. So it was this wide angle lens that Julius had that I think was a critical piece to just how he viewed life and took on monumental challenges. And you see it play out throughout his career, going on to the LBJ school, and then ultimately getting a law degree and practicing law as a district attorney in Dallas. We were in law school together for two years. We didn't have a lot of role models at that time. There was only one black lawyer in Austin. So for many of us, we were glad to be there. Uh, and we were part at that time, that entering class in the fall of 76, um, was one of the larger classes for women, for blacks, um, for Mexican-American students. We didn't just have the luxury to come and be law students. We still understood we had a broader battle to fight. I see that journey um, with, with Julius and um, those who really set the foundation for, for what it meant to be a law student here, what it meant to be a black law student here. People like Julius set a, a stage for us to have a community here. Julius loved being a lawyer. Julius loved being provocative, pushing the edge. How can I stretch? How can I grow? What can I learn about myself to make myself even stronger, more competitive? He took, I think, each day at a time and embraced the opportunities here and embraced the challenges head on. Julius was a great Texan, a great Longhorn, a wonderful alumni of this law school, and we are absolutely grateful for him.